There's a reason why we have two ears and one mouth. So we can listen more and talk less. That's not my dog. <laughs> I can't take photo of my dog. They're very <coughs> animated. Tips number four for me is do this three C's. Critical communication checklist. First of all, when you hear something, make sure, is it true? In this day and age, there are just too many hoax news. I'm sure you agree with me. Yeah. Maybe nine out of ten news we receive in our WhatsApp and groups are hoax. So before you spread it, before you say it, before you redistribute it, ask, is it true? Number two, is it kind? Okay, yeah, so it's true that, oh, this guy has an affair with that girl. But is it kind? Do you really need to tell others about it? If no, don't. Number three, it's true, it's kind. Natasha is the winner of Miss Indonesia 2016, and she's the runner-up of Miss World 2016. It's true, it's kind. Is it necessary? Yes, it is necessary for young people to know about her achievements. So do, spread the information, tell the story. However, if it doesn't tick this box, if it doesn't tick that box, or that, you better sip it up. Sh sip it shut, because your mouth and your tongue is the smallest organ in the body, but it can do the most damage. Number three, speak confidently to everyone, to, in everywhere, every time. You're sitting next to someone in the busway, you're spending an hour and a half to get home or to work. Spend that time, use that time to speak to someone in real life, rather than someone in your Snapchat. You don't even know who they are, if they're real people or not. So use your time to speak confidently, effectively, to real people, to everyone. Every time, everywhere. 